Oh, wait a minute. I was literally going to trade the pink egg. Look at this guy. He's trading a named pink egg. Dude, that's even more rare than mine. How did he get that? Oh my, oh my gosh. What is his name? Gnome uh, Void. Let me see if we can trade him. There we go. He put it up. I can't believe he has that. What the heck? That's crazy. You guys, when it's named, a named egg means it's a really, really old egg because a long time ago in Adopt Me, you could name your eggs. And then after an update, they didn't let you do that anymore. So it makes it even more rare, right? You can't name an Aussie egg or any other egg. I do have some pink eggs, you guys. Funny enough, that's what we're going to trade today. I'll give him two pink eggs for a named one. Hopefully he does it, man, because that's... I think that's all I'm gonna do here. Let's see, man. Dude, that's a named pink egg. That's crazy. What a way to start the video. By the way, oh, he's actually gonna do it. By the way, I don't know if you guys have noticed or not, but I love the freaking, they finally got rid of the snow and all that, that fall look. It's all like, it was all faded and glossy and really bright. I'm never a fan of that, dude. I like the bright green. It's, it looks a lot more clear. Okay, anyways, here we go. Hit accept, come on, bro. I'm doubling your pink egg, <laughs> except, and you guys, we're still gonna do another pink egg after this, okay? Even if he does give me this one, we're still gonna trade another one, um, just to see what we can get for it. What is, he said, I don't know if I should do it. Do it, come on. He asked me if I'm recording. I said, yes, I'm recording, do it. <laughs> <laughs> I want this named pink egg, bro. I'm trying to pressure him into doing it. Uh, he said, okay, fine. <laughs> Why did he type that? It seems like he doesn't want to do it. Uh, the trade was successful. Okay, heck yeah, dude. I just got a named pink egg. Let's go. And I still got a, another one as well. Now, again, you guys, before we trade away the uh, regular pink egg, we're kind of going to work our way up. I have a lot of other eggs. We'll start off with, um, well, this one's not super old. It was the last egg that was in the game. Um, and that is the ocean egg, which I think I might have like a hundred of. Oh, I have 87 of them. Oh my gosh, a mega bat dragon. I didn't even see that. This person is rich. Oh my gosh. Let me put up just, I don't know, three ocean eggs. Let's see what Coral Pony does. Now, a fossil egg is older than an ocean egg, so it's a pretty good deal, but... A lot of people um, got fossil eggs before they left, right? Like the eggs that are really, really valuable are the uh, the safari egg, the jungle egg, and well, maybe the Aussie egg right now, right? But fossil, ocean, mythic aren't worth a whole lot. Um, yeah, okay, they put up a lot of pets. I I'll for sure do it. I mean, I have like a million of these eggs anyways. All right, there we Oh, we both hit accept at the exact same time. That's kind of funny. Up next, you guys, is the fossil egg. Now for this one, I honestly, I'd take anything for it, <laughs> to be honest with you. I put up three of I have a lot of these, you guys, because I remember buying them before they left the game just in case in the future they went up a value a whole lot, which might not happen for like another year or something. But, you know, that's why I have like 40 of them right now, or I mean 30. Ooh, Neon Swan? For three fossil eggs? That seems like a really good deal. I don't know where the swan comes from, but I know for a fact that it's way older than the fossil egg and I have a ton of fossil eggs. And then again, this swan is neon. That's crazy. Alrighty, there we go. What the heck? That was really fast, dude. Eggs are so easy to trade away. Everybody wants them. Man, dude, we are going through these trades really, really fast. Let's go ahead and trade a Unicorn Gamer 22 uh, 12 now. And up next, what we're going to trade is a neon. Dude, everyone here is so rich. Oh my God. Literally, if you guys want to join this server, link is in the description. Um, this is trading server number two, I think, the one that I'm in right now. Uh, anyways, Unicorn Gamer is not going to offer for the swan, so we'll decline her. And we'll trade Mikey Mike. Now, I'm not too picky, honestly, on what I can get for the swan. I have a lot of them, uh, then like three neon, so I'll take anything, really. Uh, as long as I'm not getting like ripped off hard, you know? Uh, Mikey Mike 9090 is offering me... Okay, Neon Kitsune is a Robux pet. A Guardian Lion, I think, is also a Robux pet. Phoenix comes from the Mythic Egg. Golden Penguin is technically a Robux pet. It's a hard one to get, too. Um, we'll hit accept. I mean, four pets for one ugly little bird. Seems like a, seems like a pretty good deal to me. Dude, we have been trading really, really fast. Who's this? Oh, lost my head. Oh, my gosh. What happened to her head? <laughs> and she has a Mega Shadow Dragon, too. That's crazy. So, Gnome Void is offering me... We'll hit accept on this one. He said, I shall do it. <laughs> oh, heck yeah, dude. The Metal Oxes... You guys know that they're not really worth, like, anything at all, to be honest. Just, just because they were so easy to get. Even though this was a legendary one, the ox boxes were, like, everybody could get them so easily. Um, so there's a lot of them in the game. Um, but the Snow Owl, that one is from last Christmas. Not, not the Christmas that just passed, but the last, last Christmas. And then the Ninja Monkey was also a seasonal pet no longer in the game. Dude, that was a good trade. We are on fire today, man. I think I'll just do this one. It doesn't seem too bad, and I'm, I need pets. You guys know I need pets right now. There we go. Okay, I guess this isn't too bad. Now, in my opinion, honestly, I do feel like it's worth a lot more than those pets, but I'm kind of desperate right now. I just want to move on. Oh, wait, no, she wants a neon butterfly. 
Oh, wait, no, they hit accept. Okay. She typed in neon butterfly, question mark. <laughs> but I think I already traded that away. So here we go. Let's see what happens here. I'm not sure if she's going to do it. I hope she does. Alrighty, here we go. Let's confirm. Oh, we both hit accept at the same time. Nice. Right now, we're going to do a neon arctic fox. And I'm not going to lie. I don't know where it comes from. I What the heck? I didn't even see what this person put up. Dang, dude, Lola's rich. Bro, I gotta stop talking and pay attention to what they're putting up. She was, what the heck? That's crazy. As I was saying, I don't know where the Arctic Fox came from. It might be Christmas related, right? Because it's an Arctic Fox, so it's kind of like snow related. I want to say the Christmas egg from like three years ago. I think uh, that's what I'm going to go with. I want to say it's a three-year-old pet and yeah and they're putting up a lot for it because i think this girl knows that it's worth a lot weirdly enough you don't ever see anybody with a with an arctic fox like literally when you join any server nobody ever has an arctic fox let alone a, a neon one i feel like people should definitely want these more <laughs> I, I don't know if they just don't look cool or what but here we go i hit accept let's see what lola does lola actually hit accept I didn't think she was gonna do it. What the heck, bro? Oh my goodness. I think it would be so cool if Adopt Me did drops like a uh, Pet Simex, dude. I think the game would take off even more. Cause I feel like I feel like a lot of people aren't playing Adopt Me anymore. If they did weekly like drops like uh Pet Simex where they release those Robux pets, like tier one, tier two, and tier three, that would be so freaking cool, dude. And then everybody would hop on trying to get those pets every single week. You know, that would be so cool. Anyways, Adore Jade is all I'm actually gonna hit it. <gasps> Why didn't I hit accept? Uh, let's go ahead and trade Sanvu. Okay, a Neon Buffalo, uh, a Griffin, which is a Robux pet, Unicorn, Australian Kelpie, and a Crab. I think this person's a noob. We're just gonna give it to them. We'll just let them keep it. I wanna trade the pink egg already, so we'll just do this trade. Even though I do feel like the seahorse is worth just a little bit more. Uh, again, you guys, I mentioned this at the beginning of the video. To join this server, link is in the description, okay? I think this is server number two. Once you enter my Roblox group, I have like a ton of trading servers. Um, I mean, look at it, bro. There's so many like legendary pets around here. You better stop playing with me, bro, because if you try to give it to me, I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it, man. <laughs> um, anyways, now we're finally on the, uh, on the pink cat on the pink cat on the pink egg now again the pink egg is i want to say it's the first egg ever added to the game it was either that or the blue egg i want to say they came out around the same time but the only thing you can hatch from the pink egg like the reason it's not super insanely valuable is because it's not like you can hatch 10 different pets from it right the only thing that's inside the pink egg is the pink cat anyways here we go we are trading any zero one two three four five nine and bro what is up with all these rich people man why why can't they offer for a pink egg i love that rich people are trading me but it, it always kind of sucks because they want me to offer for like the really good pets you know adore jade is uh offering me a parrot now that i might actually do should i hit accept first or is that gonna make me come off as desperate okay she hit accept first i'll hit accept now okay here we go let's go ahead and hit confirm now i made it seem like i was thinking about it when in reality i know i want it and oh there we go okay they hit accept anyways you guys that's gonna be the end of this video make sure to subscribe i'll see you in the next one